Summer 2021 for me was absolutely fantastic as my family decided to get a new puppy. Her name is Poppy and she is a Yorkshire Terrier puppy. We already have an old Yorkshire Terrier called Lucy who is also the mascot of this channel and we wanted to get the same breed. My family has always had a particular love for Yorkies and because of Lucy and Poppy we probably always will have now. I decided to collect some footage of Poppy growing up this summer for a personal vlog for you to enjoy, but also for me to look back on in the future. This video is a bit late due to constant university deadlines, but hopefully you still enjoy. In the meantime, I've got a brand new microphone that is hopefully a lot better quality. Please enjoy. So Poppy was born April 25th, 2021. We collected Poppy from her litter on June 30th, 2021 and my family instantly fell in love. I honestly forgot how small and delicate puppies are. However, I really did not remember how energetic and crazy they can be. Poppy has quite a silly and mischievous personality. She is always getting into trouble and messing around. She has done some really cheeky and funny things as a puppy. She loved to steal straws out of people's drinks if they were left on the ground. Then she started taking socks out of the washing pile. Then finally she started hiding in the garden when I asked her to come in. In comparison, my older dog Lucy is a lot more calmer and quieter. I was extremely worried that Poppy and Lucy would not get on. Although Lucy was definitely scared of Poppy at first, they gradually got more tolerant towards each other. Poppy really loves Lucy and I think Lucy has a reluctant sort of respect for Poppy now. Though I don't think Lucy likes it when Poppy tries to hog all the attention. Poppy is a lot more food motivated compared to my other dog. Poppy absolutely adores treats and she's learned quite a few tricks now. She now knows how to sit, beg, lie down, roll over and spin. However, she did take quite a while to toilet train properly. To get Poppy more socialised, I took her to a wide variety of different locations. I took her to loads of dog parks, the beach, to shops that allow pets and even the pub. She is quite an adventurous little puppy. Due to the major socialisation I did with her, she's so well behaved outside. She is so friendly with other dogs and loves the attention she gets outside. Poppy got me to go outside a lot more than I did in previous summers. Poppy loves playing in the garden, sometimes she even just sits outside on her own. When she gets the zoomies it is so funny, she just runs around the garden like mad. We got a major heatwave over the summer this year and in order to get some exercise Poppy just played in the garden. It was helpful that she could use up some of her puppy energy safely despite the heat. We got Poppy loads of new toys and dog activities. This really stopped her chewing up the house as puppies just love to chew. However, at one point she did chew my laptop wire, which was frustrating but I did forgive her. Also, we found this interactive toy that forces her to work out how to get the food which was so helpful. It used up some of her energy throughout the day. She now knows how to do it rather quickly though, so it's not as effective.
Towards the end of the summer, we decided to enter Poppy in a dog competition in our local area. She was dead excited when she saw all the other dogs and little puppies. We decided to enter Poppy into the best puppy competition. She was a bit older at this point, so we thought that a younger puppy would definitely win. However, Poppy came in first place. We think the judges were made up with her when she kept rolling on her belly to get strokes off everyone. I had such an amazing summer in 2021. It was honestly one of the best summers I can remember. Poppy really improved my whole family's life. It has been a lot of hard work, but she is definitely worth it. Thank you so much for watching and please let me know about your own dogs and pets if you want to.